Well, I'm miniaturized. I don't have an item to back me up. I'm pretty much just going in uh, full basic. Screw it. I can handle it. I'm going to show you just how pro I really am. And finally, it's time. Oh, boy. One of these. Oh, wait. I'm mini. Oh, God. Ha! Oh, this is going to be a freaking treat. All right, everybody. Welcome back to more Let's Play uh, New Super Mario Brothers. This is your host, MJ406, and here we are! The final castle! And of course, there's star coins here, too! We gotta go through the last of the traps that, they, that Bowser has set for us, and hope to God that we can finish it. Alright, then. Oh, God. Dang it, it should be too bad. Unless you fall! Again! Sorry. Alright, well, now I'm not super mini, it might be a little more balanced for me. So anyway, yeah. We finally made it. It's time to take down this tyrant, or rather his kid. His kid's the one calling all the shots now. The one who still is the princess. We took out Bowser. Oh, God damn it! Not again! Are you kidding me, man? Oh, I could keep blaming the gamepad like I did the previous few parts, but no. This time, it's just me being awful. Like I said, being bad at video games is art. Like so. <laughs> anyway, yeah, we took out Bowser a long time ago, so... Bowser Jr. is the only one who could stand in our way at this point. The question is, how can he be tougher than he has been already? There's not really a sign of him, like, doing anything more. He just fights a little smarter, but that's about it. And even then, it's... Eh. Oh, shit. I, I screwed that up. I wanted to do that. Alright, well, I remember how to get most of the stuff here, so this shouldn't be too bad. Once you get the star coins, we're in the clear. And, of course, you can't tell you're gonna need to use these to be able to manipulate your way around. Hmm. That was a weird choice there. Oh, God. Yeah. And thank goodness for a checkpoint. Very near the end, too. So there's really not a whole lot left. Ooh, but free freaking power-ups. Yes. I'll be very grateful to take those. Oh, Jesus. Hang on. I remember how to get the last one now. Oh, God. Can I still do it? No, you suck! Well, sorry to do this, but I want to get them all in one run. So, do the same thing we always do. Enter a new level, quit, or return to map, rather, and then go back in. You fucking pussy. I've discussed this already. It's saving time and doing strategy. Why ruin the surprise this level has for us by going through it a second time just to get one star coin when I can just do it all now? Come on, Mario, use your brain. Believe me, if I could, I would have killed you already. So you can't use your brain? Apparently not! Hmm, that sucks. Okay, so remember the way these blocks are. For the second star coin, you want this one at the top here. For this one, you want to keep it at the bottom. Also, if I'm not mistaken, I'm pretty sure... You want to do it in one run, because if you end up having to use a checkpoint, you're kind of screwed on this one. At least the memory serves me right. Which I hope it does. Because then, uh, yeah. I want to make sure I remember everything properly instead of what I've been doing and not remembering anything properly. See, look. Now there's a platform there. You'll need that to get the last star coin just sitting over here. On a very precarious platform. I hate these timing ones. These are kind of dumb. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, I panicked. Come on, we're right there. Don't ruin this for me. Sorry. All right, anyway, let's go take on Bowser Jr. one last time. I'm going to Bowser statues here. <laughs> Good luck being my dad. What are you talking about? I'm still alive, bitch. Wait, what the hell? Now I am. Hey, it's Dry Bowser! Everybody loves this guy! He's invulnerable to fireballs, and yeah, Bowser is alive again. 
Hey, wait, wait, don't hit that switch! Oh! Okay. No! Oh, nice. Now he's dead! I hate those undead bastards! Now! That bell is dead for real! I'm not dead with you yet! Wait! Hey! Come on! You have nowhere to run! Oh, but look at the bottom screen, the map expanded! Dun dun dun! Yeah, if you like the World 8 was too short and why this isn't the finale, here you go! This is bullshit! Come on, we're gonna have a fun time in my room! He has a room? Well, here we go. The true meat of World 8. And the music changed a little bit. Now we're the second half. This is where it gets really intense. You gotta deal with the horror helmet, but come on. What's a Bowser world without some fire? Now is where we get into the deep, the meat and thick of it. I really do like this music, by the way, though. It's not super intense or scary, but... No, it gives you the it gives you the sense that you're near the end. It's a final challenge. Then again, I like the world eight of this game more than most of the other Mario games. I mean, the new Super Mario Bros. games. Sorry, I should clear that up before somebody accuses me of liking this more than Mario Three or Mario World, which I've stated plenty of times. While this and the Wii U one, in my opinion, are really good. Sorry. The third and fourth 2D Mario games will not be matched. Or at least they haven't yet. I just don't see anything matching their brilliance. However, the star coins in the last four levels are actually particularly easy, surprisingly. It's weird. It's more the difficulty of the level themselves, although that one's just a breeze in general. But yeah. We must approach our way to the end. There's only five stages left. I can tell because of the star coin count. I know how many I'm going to have overflow by the time I get all of them at the end of the game. There's a reason for that. Ah, yes, this level. Look at all this crap we got going on. And if you didn't notice, well, you have lava, which I should have done this. But now I could die. I won't, though, thankfully. Level wrapping, and you have to race against the lava. This one's a stressful level. And this one, I somewhat forget where the, uh, one of the star coins is. It's not terrible, but... Well... I have to be careful. Oh man, Spideys! Okay, I think I want to be on this side? Yep. Yep, there we go. Okay. Remember how level wrapping works so you can get your way to the end. Do that, you're good. And I said this is going to be hard. I honestly thought it was. <laughs> yeah, see, now we're going to be blazing through to the end of this game. I mean, I don't know if we'll get through the last level, but we're going to be pretty damn close. 8-7. Let's go. So let's see. Okay, this one's a little harder. This level is basically what I like to call the enemy hell. This level... Oh, yeah! Sledge bros. These fat hammer bros throw big hammers at you and, well... Yeah, they do that. They also happen to have a stomping attack, I believe, which you can tell from their animation. When they do, you'll be stunned if you're on the ground when they pull it off. So, don't be on the ground for it. Hey, they even brought the, the wall clinging back. Oh, yeah. I noticed 8-5, I don't think, at a checkpoint. Like I said, these levels tend to be harder than the, uh, ones earlier in the game. Although, I'm doing pretty well. Oh, God, Fire Bros. Secretly, my least favorite bro from Mario Brothers 3 onward. Well, this will certainly help some things. Because I can kill so much now. 
Only for a little bit, though. This is where the sledge bro can get annoying. Although he's not doing the attack. That's nice of him. All right. Well, since that happened to be so easy, I guess I'll just make my way to the end. Not the boomerang! Ow. That's fine. I'm not gonna... Oh, I didn't even hit the top. You need to play the original Mario Brothers. What the hell? Why? Why you say that now? I just felt like it. Hmm. Okay. Well, it's good we have this time, because, uh... Hey! Guess what we're doing again? Are you kidding me? We need another mini mushroom? Yes. And I was gonna say, maybe better just to have, hold on to a mini mushroom to take with me, which, yeah. I think I showed off the mushroom houses at least once. Not a bad idea to bring one of those along. But... Here's the thing. Unlike the... 8-4, where you only need the mini mushroom for the end, you need this one kind of early on. And, uh, well... Let's just say, if you try to think you could beat the level without another power-up on hand, you're really challenging yourself big time. Oh, man, I gotta make sure the gamepad's closer to the Wii U. I think that's the problem. I keep the gamepad too far away. I'll try to keep that in mind. Then again, that would explain a lot of why there are going to be some problems with one sensing the other. Alright then. Let's open up the final sign gate! This way, I can just keep coming back here. It'll save us a lot of time, believe me. Okay. Now. Let's go deal with the hell that is. World 8-8. This level is actually legitimately hard compared to the previous three, because who doesn't love a meteor shower? I love meteor showers. That's a volcano eruption, you liar! I mean, yeah, more specifically, it's a volcano eruption, but... Oh, man. And we got new bombs here. They get hit by a meteor, they'll start going berserk and try to frickin', you know, blow up everything. Oh, God. This level could be a pain! Why'd you do that? I forgot. Oh god! Forgot, 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 uh... Let's go back to the file. Seriously! You're such a little bitch! I can't help it! If I'm a little bitch for today, I don't care. I just want to get it done, please. Okay, you're the boss! Now show me! Lead by example! Instead of leading with an iron fist, you dickhead! Oh, this level is a nightmare for me. This is also one of the hardest star coins of the game for me to get. Because it's getting to the level that's a tough spot for me. You have to make it through all this hell. When those bombs get lit, you're in danger. And those bombs still get to the way! That they do. Oh, this level will take up most of the time this episode, I'm sure. At least compared to everything else. Then again, I had a feeling it would. We could probably get the next fortress taken care of, but if not, well... I at least warned you in advance that this is gonna happen. <laughs> Don't laugh, it's not funny! It just makes you sound like an asshole, I know. I'm prepared to take the blame for being an asshole. You can still jump on enemies, though. The bombs are only... bad to the horizontal touch, not the vertical. Notice this you need either a meteor to crash down Or a bomb to blow that up so you can get in here And now we have a maze Once you're in here, it's not bad, but it's getting through here that you need to be able to do Use some of the coins to give you a pathway, but uh, you know try to look ahead if you can I Try to memorize the route although I somewhat forget it sometimes yeah, I got it. Okay. And then you don't have to find a way out. Although, I think the way out is much easier. Yeah, they press you for time, kind of, in here. It's like, yeah, you think getting through the maze is so easy. 
You find take a lot of time getting in here? Well, you better not take a lot getting out. You're gonna hate life if you do. Okay, there we go. And now, this is my way of finishing this level off. Once you do that, well, you go back backwards a little bit. And take another fire flower. You can ignite these bombs yourself. And careful with these. They blow up in the air, so don't... If you see them standing still, you know, you're better off not standing still. Although well, you can pound them to get rid of them entirely, so there's that. So yeah, wait for the meteors to open the way to that last one. There we go. That's all the freaking star coins of the main stages. No, it's hard to get out of here. Oh, I think there's a star in that block. Oh, standard jumping works too. Yeah! Woo! Well, that is very soothing. Although, I'm glad I saved the time that I did because this, this fortress. Fortress 2, the only other world in the game that has a second fortress. And oh, this one's a dick, because remember a couple parts ago when I said the new Super Mario Bros. games had to have at least one level that had the snake blocks? Here's level 2! And it's certainly worse than World 7's castle. Oh, God! Except you take these snake blocks the entire trip. So, get comfortable. The route's a little more treacherous, although I don't think the star coins are as bad. Still, you're in for a harder run at the snake blocks this time around. Because they'll be doing massive ascents. You want to make sure you're on the snake blocks when they go fully up like that. Oh, God. Well, there is a checkpoint for you. The snake blocks restart right here if you happen to die past the checkpoint. But now is where it gets a little tricky. Oh, come on! Now these are just wasting time! Move up already! Thank you! And here's a power for you in case you need it. Which is more than likely, I'm sure. Ow! Well, I missed a one-up. You suck. Yeah, sorry about that. Okay. Well, so far, so good. Ow! Sorry. Oh, yeah, surprises. Be, be on the lookout for that. That's a warning to tell you we got more of those to put up with. Are you serious? Yeah. Look. Oh, no. Oh, come on! Oh, what the hell? Get, get, get off! Get off the bike! There we go! The snake box won't let anybody be their bitch. Absolutely nobody. Wow, these, these coins weren't hard to... Oh! Oh, God. Like I said, surviving the level that's hard. Although, I did it all in one try. Never mind. That's easier than World 7's castle. Time to die, bitch! Jesus! The final battle with Bowser Jr. I'm only kidding. There is still one more level after this. Come on, you little bitch! Find me like a real man! Come on! It's your time to shine! Show me what you're made of! Come on! I am not the crook! Why'd you say that? Because I'm not the one stealing somebody else's bitch! She's my mama! We've been over this! Well, and with that... Dun, dun, dun! It's the final level! Bowser's Castle! Are we ready for this? Probably. So let me just review all the worlds before we do that. So we have World 1's Star Coins are complete there, and all the routes are unlocked. World 2, all the routes are unlocked, Star Coins there. World 3, all the Star Coins unlocked, other routes are there. All the star coins are there, all the routes. I'm just doing this for my own sanity to check it out. And burn time. 
World 5, got all the store coins, got all the routes there. Ah. World 6, got all the routes and star coins there. That's World 8, genius. Go to World 7, learn to count, please. At World 7, I did all that, thankfully. And no, there's not a secret route around towards the end, in case you were wondering. Hmm. Now I think about it, I may as well bolster up my lives since, you know, there's only one level left. You yeah, little pads, you son of a bitch, Bang! Here you go! Get some more life for yourself! Why did I think of doing this earlier? Oh, well. Yeah, bitch! We've maxed out! Yes! I'm now ready to take on that king asshole! I'm glad. You made Bowser Jr. the new king? Yes! What? what are, are we saying something we shouldn't be? Probably. It's a Super Mario game! Why am I saying that? Because even you know. Even you know. Well. That's why this episode is short. Come back next time. Are you kidding me? And we will take on the final castle and save Princess Peach once and for all. So next time is the finale? You could have beaten this now! It just made it extended! Eh, screw that. Like I said, I'm trying to bolster this game's length. Wow, you really are a dick! Hey, I learned it from the best. Me? I actually meant my dad, but okay, take the blame. Oh, you are a sick mother-